So these are my little double nuke boxes I use for brood. You can see all these here for brood production. So I've got number 74 and 75, but they're actually two colonies. 74 is one, colony, 75 is another. And there's a division board in the middle where my DSV number is between 74 and 75. And you can see the top two are just supers, but they're all brood supers. They're not half size supers. So I use this, each colony has five over five. So if I come around the other side, you'll see this other side. There we are. That's the back side of it. And they're absolutely happy as Larry. So there we are. So here's my cell builder on the day of grafting. I've just made this hive, hopelessly queenless. This brood box on top with eight frames and two missing from the middle was originally on top of this box. This box was in place of here. So what I've done is I've made it hopelessly queenless by moving the queen and some of her brood, enough to keep her going, just to the other side away from everywhere else and giving her the hive but with just enough bees to keep the brood warm whereas the rest of the brood that was on top was above a queen excluder is now here with the super underneath to keep it warm so here there's no queen excluder it's just an open box with tons and tons and tons of nurse bees that are hopelessly queenless because in that box the brood that's there that was on top of this hive above a queen excluder so you can imagine there's no eggs been laid in there at all and all the bees that I put in there that were in larvae have now hatched out and you can see them there they're all nurse bees so we have a huge box of bees with no queen they're hopelessly queenless they're flying around they're calling they're trying to find some eggs there's nothing for them to make a new queen with and they'll all be whizzing around this afternoon till I put the graft in this evening so there you go a hopelessly queenless setup and that's how it works. So here we are, ready to stick the graft in. Here's my graft. Here's my hopelessly queenless hive with a honey super on the bottom and a box packed full of bees and brood and field bees and bees shaken from this colony, which was the original colony, which I have turned around and faced the other way. This is the front of this one facing the exact same place. Totally confused bees, no queen. So Let's get our graph ready. They're now hopelessly queenless. There's our graph. So I've been a bit greedy, got a lot of cells there, but uh, I only want to do this once, I hope. Let's open up this hive. It's going to be packed full of bees. Here we are. Absolutely overflowing with bees. Here we are, and stick the graft in. So in goes the graft. <laughs> 